Now just less than two hours away from when there will be some relief for drivers out there in Sandy Springs, the Mount Vernon Bridge over I-285 is set to reopen. And that's where we find Atlanta News First reporter Brittany Ford. Brittany, this has been a bit of a traffic headache for months. It has. This has been a construction mess for over the last six months, trying to get this bridge back up and running. And you can take a live look out here. Construction crews are now on site preparing for that reopening. But this bridge hasn't been able to catch a break. You can take a look at some video here. This was just about a week ago when it was clipped by a dump truck, causing a massive traffic backup. And back in September, a similar situation with another large truck that clipped it. In that case, they were forced to shut the bridge down altogether. Now, since then, construction has been ongoing. Leading up to today, we spoke with some people in the area who are, needless to say, relieved. It was detours, very, very devastating. I do have to say the only thing that we will miss is no traffic on this road. It was almost like a pedestrian highway. <laughs> we could walk in the middle of the street every morning. <laughs> Now, GDOT says it will be limited traffic to start, but people will be able to now access the bridge without going through that detour. The bridge is set to open at 9 a.m. Reporting live in Sandy Springs, Brittany Ford, Atlanta News First.